Hello, welcome to Micromain Global Tutorials. Today, I'll be showing you how to create filters. Most modules in Micromain Global provide the option to create filters and then save those filters. Creating filters will allow you to quickly access predefined data sets. Uh, so to begin creating a filter, we're gonna go ahead and go to our work orders. So to do that, we're gonna click on operations. We're gonna click on work orders. And in our work order screen, we're going to come up to the upper right hand corner and select this carrot. If you hover over it, it says expand. Go ahead and click on that. And this right here is going to expand your filter fields. Uh, as you can see, we have a couple. We have services, assets, phases, status, etc. So depending on what you want, you can go ahead and click in the field box and you can either select uh, what you're looking for in the drop down menu or you can go ahead and type uh, and select it that way. So for this example, uh, let's see, let's go ahead and select uh, air handler, status, we want open, and the shops, let's put electrical. So based on my filters, I narrowed down my work orders to one work order. So if I wanted to save this filter, um, so every time I come look for a work order um, regarding these certain fields, we're just going to come up to the upper right-hand corner and select this uh, martini glass. Click on it, it says save or recall fields, I'm sorry, filters. Go ahead and click on that, and it's going to ask you for a name. Um, so we're going to put uh, MM Tutorial, uh, and it also shows you the, the filters that you have selected. And go ahead and click Save Filter, and it tells you right here that it was successfully created. Uh, so uh, you're, you're done. That um, right there completes on how to create a filter in Microman Global. If you have any other questions or want to learn more about the Microman Global software, please visit our website or email the address shown on the screen, or you can give us a call at 888-888-1600. Thank you.